I'm Karen Ross, and uh, this is Tom Ross, and this is Pearl, and we all live in Flagstaff, Arizona. We have uh, six labs uh, at home. They're a lot of fun, they love to play, and then they also make great couch potatoes. Pearl is almost seven years old. She just is very happy, uh, and she loves to play and run. This was a leg injury. This is actually our sixth TPLO surgery, the first one we've had here at uh, Animal Specialty Group. Two of our other dogs both had their knees done, and Pearl had one knee done uh, at another uh, clinic in the, in the valley. We took her to our primary vet up in Flagstaff. She said, oh, you have got to talk to Ross Lertzman. She said he is a really good surgeon, and he's very meticulous. And I'd never heard her say that about anybody before. Uh, she said he's very knowledgeable, and so we uh, called up and got an appointment, and we came down. We were very impressed. Just the feel when you walk in the door is very calm and very considerate and very caring. We came into one of the consultation rooms and we had a dog bed and she laid down and she was comfortable and I thought, if she's comfortable, <laughs> that's half the battle right there. Karen Ross and her dog Pearl is, uh, is, is, is another great story I think to tell. Uh, this is a family who has, uh, who has uh, a lot of dogs, a lot of Labradors, uh, many of which have had ACL problems in their knees. And one of the reasons we're particularly proud of Pearl's story is uh, to see by comparison. While a similar technique, I think we, we saw some very different outcomes in Pearl. Uh, we, we, we believe it's because of our approach. Uh, it's because of, of surgical technique. It's because of, of unique orthopedic implants that we use that we saw a very rapid and, and uncomplicated healing of the bone of the tibia after performing TPLO surgery. Uh, Pearl's experience for us at Animal Specialty Group is very common. This is what we expect to see after these operations. But I think in Karen Ross's situation, it was very different from her previous experiences. It was great. It, you know, we really felt comfortable knowing he knew so much and, and was so confident in what he was doing, but also cared so much about getting the dogs back on their feet. So they care about the people too, which is a big deal. I mean, I, I think most vets care about dogs, but a lot of them don't carry that over into their people skills. And so you feel kind of you know, stupid asking questions or I'm bothering them, I don't want to call or email. I was encouraged to contact them with anything, so it, it, was, it was great, it was a great experience.